In this video, we'll figure out the oxidation number here for this iron in Fe2Cr2O73. This is iron 3, and this is the dichromate ion, so iron 3 dichromate. The whole thing, if we added up all these oxidation numbers here, it would equal zero. This is a neutral compound. There's no plus or minus after it. So we know the whole thing's going to equal zero. The problem we have here is iron, that's a transition metal, and chromium is also a transition metal. So we have to look at what they're bonded to to figure out their oxidation numbers. The trick is that the chromium is in what we call the dichromate ion, really one you just have to memorize. This whole dichromate ion has an ionic charge of two minus. And we know if we have an ion, all the oxidation numbers add up to the charge on the ion. So all these oxidation numbers, they'll add up to two minus. So for the whole thing, three times two minus, all of these oxidation numbers gives us a minus six. Remember we said this was a neutral compound. All the oxidation numbers have to add up to zero. So the iron has to be, somehow we have to have plus six here. Two times plus three, that gives us plus six. So that works out. We know that the iron is going to have, each iron is going to have a plus three oxidation number. That's why we call this iron three dichromate. If you need help finding the oxidation number for the chromium in Cr2O7 with this 2 minus the dichromate ion, there's a link in the description to help you do that. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.